this is our end result. The carrot bre bread tastes delicious. The recipe was perfect. After about five hours, late at night, I snuck out and I flipped the carrot sheets. Now this, this bread is delicious. It's just pliable. It holds together. I'm trying not to break it. This thick, it has somewhat of a a delicious soft center. It's nice and smooth on one side. Makes for the nice outside of a sandwich. And it's because of the oil content, it's kind of gooey. Uh, what it is, what I mean by gooey, is not like the ooey gooey kind of marshmallow goo, but it's like it's got gluten and some kind of really good sensory agent. When you bite into it, you just feel like you're biting into like a dessert bar, carrot cake dessert. So, this morning for breakfast, I think I'll have one of these with some jam. And instead of toast, Elizabeth. And this is Drake. Hi, Drake. Say hello. <laughs> that was perfect. Mimi. Mimi, where are you? So I hope you uh, enjoy this carrot cake. It's so warming. It has so many warming flavors and so many really delightful texture combinations to it. It's a little hard to press out into a full flat sheet, but it's well worth it. And the rounds that I did that were oh. Oh. <laughs> the rounds that I did these would make I don't know if this is going to go well with a pizza sauce with some basil on top and hummus and or the macadamia nut cheese and olives but that's the kind of pizza I want to make little personal pan pizzas you could have a plain Italian with cheese and then I could have like the pesto basil Italian type um, then I could have ooh, I could have zucchini marinated mushroom sliced onion and olive and garlic. The garlic, I'd probably want to dehydrate that one a little bit, but you could see the glistening seeds in there. And the fact that I crushed it all, it made it a really fluffy bread without having to add anything extra. This is exactly like they say it is in the restaurant. Her restaurant's name is Love. Um, the owner of the restaurant <clears throat> calls this Wonder Bread um, when it's made with the cumin and salt and pepper and six tablespoons of herbs like the Italian herb seasoning. Um, but I made it with the cinnamon and allspice and um, or cinnamon, star anise. And, well, this is good. You got the recipe from the first part of the video. And that's
let's see. I didn't write her name down. Um, all right, well, the person who invented this recipe has hundreds of recipes, and she sells her food stuff under the name of uh, Divine Organics. So the things that she sells, all the ingredients are organic, they're ready to go. And you'll also notice the word love on the packaging of some of the breads, I believe, because that is the name of the restaurant. And if you are in L.A., you must go down there. You must try it. And I really have enjoyed her contribution to my kitchen with this recipe that I've really, I kind of tweaked it, but it's totally my taste now. Carrot bread. I love it. Have a wonderful day. And I'll be here enjoying the rain in my cabin in the woods.